There were more than 50 incidents of piracy and armed robbery in Asian waters during the first half of 2020. That's nearly double the number in the same period last year. The Singapore Strait saw 16 incidents on board ships compared to just 8 12 months ago. The latest figures have been released by the RECAP Information Sharing Center, that's a regional cooperation agreement on combating piracy and armed robbery against ships in Asia. Among the 16 incidents on board ships while underway in the Singapore Strait in the first half of this year, only one led to a crew member being injured. Although this reflects a similar trend in Asia, where the severity of incidents hasn't worsened between January and June year on year, Recap says it remains an area of concern. Although the, the level of severity is not very high, rather the low level of severity of most of the incidents, uh, we think that if these uh, well, relatively small uh, crimes, if they are not addressed correctly, that may encourage the criminals to uh, commit uh, more serious crimes in the future. RECAP is calling for more coordinated patrols, vigilance and enforcement among the littoral states of Singapore, Indonesia and Malaysia. The Singapore Strait comprises their territorial waters and their navies cannot cross international boundaries to enter the waters of another nation. The Information Sharing Centre adds it's possible that the negative economic impact of the COVID-19 pandemic could have led to the rise of such incidents, although Mr Kuroki says there's currently no evidence to prove this. Meanwhile, the Singapore Shipping Association tells CNA that the unarmed nature of most of the incidents further suggests they were crimes of opportunity and that the criminals were not professional pirates. I mean, it could be casual fishermen, it could be somebody else, but the point is that uh, passing slow, slow ships that are passing in the streets really uh, presents an opportunity for people to go aboard to have a quick buck. You know, turning around a you know generator, or, uh, uh, some cans of lubricants, and, and to turn into cash uh, to feed their families. Mr. Poon says the association has quarterly sessions with stakeholders in the maritime industry, which helps everyone to keep abreast of latest developments. A messaging system has also been set up to quickly push out notifications to companies who need to plan ahead, so they are aware of the risks in the waters they're sailing into.